Yeah, well, we've got some feel-good stories on the show. Manufacturing limbs. Well, yes, you heard right. Prosthetic technician Andrew Bates, he has his hands full and also a hands-on approach that ensures that every design is crafted to suit every patient's needs. Um, my family was very supportive and they loved the fact that I was able to help out people in a similar situation to what I am. I'm Andrew, I'm a medical orthotist prosthetist. Basically it's limb replacement, so if someone has lost a limb, an arm or a leg or possibly a finger, then a prosthetic is something that replaces that part of the body. And the process of a normal day would be the client would come in and we'd take a, a negative mould of the patient's stump with plaster Paris bandages and then we'll fill that mould up and make a positive mould and from there we'll work it off and put pressure areas where we want to. After that we will laminate a fiberglass socket and then we'll trim down the socket, get the trim lines correct and after that we'll fit it to the patient and get them walking comfortably. I'd like to say that uh, my prosthetics say that I know how to make a prosthetic leg and uh, I can get a patient walking and comfortable at the end of the day. The reason why I started um, in this field is in 2007 I lost my leg in a motorcycle accident and um, I wanted to help out people in a similar situation as me. Um, I decided to start studying prosthetics and then got placed in Cape Town and I started working in the field. My favourite prosthetic construction would be a guy I made uh, bilateral baloney baloney uh, prosthesis falls, that means he's lost both his legs and uh, he w came in on a wheelchair the one day and he left pushing his wheelchair the same day. What I love most about my job is to be able to get patients or my clients mobile again and walking and, and comfortable and get them a head start in life so they can get back to their normal daily activities. My advice to someone who wants to start studying, I would suggest you spend a week or so in the prosthetics work environment so they can see what it's all about. It's definitely not for everybody because you get very dirty and very dusty, um, but the reward is also very, very high.